Hey y'all, it's Bailey. Today I'm going to do a video on Maddie's room. Nothing specific because I kind of have a lot of things I want to talk about with y'all in this. So I'm going to go ahead and show you her room and then I'll talk. So here we go. So walking in, she has this little corner. Then we just have an owl hook for her towels. By the way, we really have no theme in here right now. We've tried to like keep it together, but this isn't the thing that I want to keep. We moved in here when I was seven months pregnant, so I just had to kind of put furniture together and decorate as we went. So this is her closet. She has a second shelf. Then this is her stuffed animals and blankets. There's her bed. Then she has a little Fisher Price dollhouse. This puppy is probably going to go in storage because she's kind of over that. Then we have her toy bucket, which has no organization whatsoever. It's just her dolls, blocks, balls, shapes, things like that. Then she has her Disney Princess Castle and all of her little people in here. Then we have her rocking chair and changing table and her stroller. As for wall decorations, we just have this little letter M. It's a bow hanger. She is not into bows, really. Hopefully that will change when she gets older, but until then, it looks pretty on her wall. <laughs> then we have this little, these are vinyl stickers. It says, good night, said the moon, turn out the light. Print it says, Madison sleeps here tonight. But when we paint, that will have to go. And I think I'm ready for it, too. I think I have my eye on some wooden letters that I want to get for her instead. And then we just have this one picture of her. That was her birth announcement. And then these little flowers came with her crib bedding, which by the way, no one told me that was the biggest waste of money ever. <laughs> and then a pink blackout curtain. So basically she has brown furniture and some pink accents, so I'm trying to decide. Tell me what y'all think looks good with brown furniture too, because I want a bright color. I do not want white. I do not want like a baby pink or a lavender. I'm thinking aqua, but white furniture looks better with that, so I don't know. She also has this rug that's like pink, green, orange, white, and purple, but I won't be too sad like that doesn't have to be incorporated into her new room all right so now we'll get into the talking basically this is kind of like her before room tour because we moved in here when I was seven months pregnant like I said we did not get to decorate or repaint or anything really so I really want to make it more themed for her like make it more fun make it more of her personality in here if you guys have any suggestions, please let me know. I've been scouring Pinterest trying to figure out what I want to do. I don't have like a set time that I want to do it. Just, I know that after she turns two, we're going to be taking out the changing table and the rocking chair. So, you know, we'll fill things in as we can go. But I do have something that I want your opinion on. So, she has this second shelf right here. She has all these clothes, but really, she, she won't always have that many clothes because these are things she just hasn't outgrown. This right here is probably all that she wears right now, and this is stuff that we just have for her to grow into. I'm debating if I should keep the second shelf or if I should take it out. I don't know. When we move her furniture, we're going to have this whole space to work with. Like, she won't have anything right here, so... I'm not sure if I want to have Nick make her one of those like wooden dress up centers for her to put all of her dress up things in. She doesn't have that much right now, but that is something that we're going to get her for her birthday because she's getting more into that. She's turning two, so she's getting more into the imaginative play and things like that. So I know that she's getting a little vanity play set for her birthday, so I don't know if I'm going to put it in the corner and then have that little like if I do that little dress up station have it right next to that right there then we have this whole space I'm not sure or if I'm gonna just I can put her dresses here on this shelf and then just have like 
her shoes and stuff down here. I can have a little wooden bin for that stuff. These are her puzzles. They don't fit in like a wire rack, so I have to figure something out with that. And this whole thing won't fit under her crib, so I have to figure that out too. But yeah, let me know what you guys think, because I really want to do this for her as soon as possible. I just, I didn't get to decorate a nursery when I was pregnant, so I'm really excited to make this room her now that I know who she is and what she likes as a little toddler. So it is sad, but in the same respect, I don't really have like huge ties to this room because I didn't get to do much with it before she was born. So that's good, I guess. Let me know if you guys have any suggestions. I'll be so thankful for them. And I'll keep you updated on what I decide to do. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.